What's going on everybody? Welcome to GMI's World and what we're going to be talking about today is how you can get yourself a free 26k in Madden 18 Ultimate Team. Now, you're probably going to have a little bit more because I've been doing the videos and been showing you that these limited time solos that's been coming out about the greatest players of all time, it's pretty much going by the jersey number. So this guy was 3,000, this guy was 5,400, this guy was 13,000, and right now we have 26,000 with, um, you know, Rod Woodson. So in this challenge, it shows you on the bottom, you see how it comes up there? You're going to play against one of the greatest cornerbacks to play the game. So what you would do, you just obviously go in it. Um, it's on all pro. Some of the other ones, I think they were lower levels. It seems to be going up as it continues to go on. So just so you're aware of it, at this point in the year, you should be able to, um, you know, beat the computer regardless of what level they're on. I will let you know this, though. I have gotten some issues from some of you guys that, you know, are maybe not as good as players. And like I said, it doesn't really matter how good you are when you're playing the CPU. It's all about the plays that you pick. So I try to tell you guys, if you're running the ball, stretch, power O, you know what I'm saying? Um, you could run slants. Uh, certain streaks work more than others. It's different things like that that I kind of display throughout my videos and um, let you guys understand exactly what needs to be done. So it shouldn't be a situation where you can't get this free 26K is what I'm saying because I like to make sure that everybody can do it equally. You understand what I'm saying? And um, regardless of what the computer do uh, or what, they, what, what happens, what they do, it doesn't really matter because they're going to always do similar things, regardless of the game mode, whatever. Uh, just like, for instance, if you play on arcade mode and you hit stick them, they're going to always fumble. You know, when you play on competitive mode, if you throw a Stevie, it's going to be an interception. Okay, so, so this is what we're going to do, right? We're just going to go to wing. Uh, this playbook that I'm using right now, this is, I believe, the Ravens. So this is the Ravens playbook, right? All we're going to do is run PA shot. I don't care that they're in competitive mode. And if for you guys that are saying, yeah, but I don't have a Randy Moss and stuff like that, get a John Ross with 98 speed. Whatever you got to do, it doesn't matter, okay? Um, but pretty much what you're going to want to do is just throw a hot one. You know what I'm saying? You're going to line up, hike the ball, and just throw it. Yes, it's competitive mode, but it doesn't really matter. All you have to do is line it up, bullet pass it down. You should be okay. Now, the game is set up, as you can see, so that you're going to be winning by one if you kick the field goal. All I'm going to tell you is be very, very careful because this is another thing that you guys have complained to me about. Yo, g my the computer cheats. They be blocking my field goals. Yeah, bro, it's EA Sports. It's in the game. It's going to happen. It doesn't matter. Kick the ball. You know what I'm saying? Take your time. Some of you guys say, yeah, bro, go full power. I don't think it really matters as much if you go full power or not because in a lot of different situations, it you know they're going to block it if they're going to block it. It's just simulated that way. Um, it's already predetermined. And that's pretty much all you would really need to do. Now... You probably wonder, like, why is EA doing this? Why is EA giving out free coins and stuff like that? The honest answer to the question is, it's the end of the year. This is the way that they draw people in, and they've been doing it like this, you know, over the last couple of years. It's just that this year, a lot of you guys are a little bit more annoyed, you know, with the lack of content, the lack of solo, stuff like that. So they're trying to give back a little bit more, which is why you got the two-minute warning, two warning solos. You got so many different type of solos that you can actually play now to get coins and to get contracts. You understand? So just make sure that you're well aware of what, what just happened there. See, these are the kind of things that go on. And like I said, you can't do anything about that. You saw the way Big Ben Roethlisberger just ran into um, Ed Two Tall Jones and nothing happened? You can't do anything about that. You have to sit there like I just did, like a complete and utter moron, and just deal with it. There is nothing else you can do. So that's why I'm trying to make sure you understand. It is what it is. This is the things that you need to make sure that are happening while you're doing it. Just, just get focused. You know what I'm saying? Come in, understand that EA is going to do whatever they want, but guess what? It's a minute, it's a minute quarter to get, you know, get 26K. And then in addition, if you just started doing it and you're trying to catch up, these are going to expire on Saturday the 26th. And again, for my Australian viewers, my down and my, my dudes, listen, make sure you understand. I believe you're a day ahead of us. Like, it always works out that way with the, um, with the way that it works. Like, you guys are like almost, your hours ahead. So try to get it done on the Friday. Don't wait it out because whatever they're going to do um, for the final one, it's just going to be much easier if you have everything else already done. All right? So make sure you take care of that. And after that, it doesn't really matter. Um, usually, they'll just... I'm just trying to run the clock out really quickly. You could take a knee, but because they had a timeout, I just run a play. Now you take the knee, and um, you pretty much do that. You know, get this game over with by taking the kneel. Um, it don't really matter if it's chew clock or not because it's under a certain amount of time. They're not going to chew clock extra when, um, you know, you have like seven seconds left. So you pretty much go ahead. You press the button. Bam, seven seconds. Let it run out real quick. 
And then that's it. That's 26K in your bank. Now, you're probably wondering, like, bro, why am I, you know, trying to make sure that I get all these coins together? This is what's happening. This is supposed to be the last week of the Ultimate Legend giveaway. I don't know if you guys uh, are aware of it, but you've been getting a card every Saturday. During, if you've logged in the month, you've gotten a card every Saturday. That goes to a free set that gives you a free Ultimate Legend. I got one of them, which was actually Rod Woodson, okay? Um, and it's just so funny. I just We just played against them right there. Okay, well, I'm now level, what is? what am I, 51? I got uh, 11,000 XP. Yeah, good luck with that. I ain't trying to do that. So there goes the coins right there. So that's the free 26K from EA Sports. And um, as we continue to go on with the greatest of all time, there's going to be other things that you can unlock. But just so you guys understand, this is what I'm talking about. This is supposed to be the last weekend because I think it ran uh, 16 weeks or something like that, right? So what happens is you're going to come here. And with the Ultimate Eleven give giveaway, this is going to be the final one. But I kind of, I screwed myself over. I put one of these into an Elite Token set to complete Eric Berry. Yeah, I was just being a complete and under idiot, and I didn't realize. The smarter thing to do, though, in the future, is just put them all in the set and just let them stay there. Um, so that way, it's, you know, you don't confuse it and take it out, whatever. Um, they do have it now updated where you can actually take them out if you accidentally put it in. But I don't know what else I'm going to be able to do with it. Because I've actually already put, you know, my free giveaway in a set. So uh, the giveaways that they've been doing are, let me go over here. I'm going to go to 80. I think they were like 85 overalls, most of them. So let's go over here and see what it is. Like this Ultimate Legend Shannon Shop. You can't sell them. You can't do anything with it. Um, and then, yeah, you see what I'm saying? So pretty much you just, you can add them to a set. And I didn't realize, usually they don't let you add these to sets. So that's why I didn't realize that I, I forgot which one I put in, one of the earlier ones. But I did get, like I told you, I did get the Rod Woodson. All right, so I got one. You know, I'm not going to complain about me being an idiot. Like, when I, if I'm an idiot, I'm an idiot. You know what I'm saying? Like, it is what it is. But where's the Rod Woodson that I got, though? There he is right there. All right, so I got this one. You can see that he's not. And it's actually the corner that I wanted. So it worked out for me a little bit that I got him. He just doesn't have the, um, the chem that I want. You know what I'm saying? Because if he would have had the toughness chem, you would see that he would be a 99 speed. And it'll be a wrapperoni with cheese. You know what I'm saying? So that's, that's the only issue with it. So that's what you have to look forward to this weekend. We don't know what the actual legends are, but people are saying that it's possibly going to be uh, Bo Jackson and something like that. And then you also have to remember the, uh, the golden tickets are additionally coming out as well. So as you do these solos that I just showed you, you're going to want to make sure that you start putting your coins together. Also, like you saw that I was on level 51, when you get to a level, level 52, you also get another 200K, okay? So this is 400K plus the 26 plus... EA is giving away coins now, all right? So you want to make sure that... You know what it is? The best of best pack, I believe it's going to be $20. I don't know if you want to spend $20 for one card and it turns out to be a complete and utter idiot because I've done this before with the best of best packs. I don't remember the card that I had, but, you know, that I got from them, but I sold it immediately. So obviously it wasn't that good. I'm going to go, I'm going to get back to you on it, whether I'm going to do it. But depending on if they do put out Bo Jackson, my situation is like a lot of you guys, I have LaDainian Tomlinson. And to be honest, the 99 overall that I have right now, I'm going to go to the item binder so I can show you uh, in full depth what's going on. He's been playing pretty well. Now that doesn't mean that he's going to play pretty well for you because based on the comments I've been getting, Dudes have been saying he's been fumbling the ball, you know, in crazy times. The 98 overall, he did that. This 99 hasn't done it to me yet. And you know what's crazy? I tried him out on aggressive, and I tried him out uh, you know, and balanced, and he didn't fumble. And aggressive is like a guaranteed fumble because everybody fumbles when you come out on aggressive. He did not. But then uh, after a couple of my other players fumbled, I went back to conservative before I went back to Ladini and Tomlinson. So I'm not saying that he won't fumble. I'm just saying that, you know, he hasn't been as bad as the 98 overall version of him, okay? So if Ultimate Legend Bo Jackson comes out, more than likely EA is not going to release the golden tickets on the same weekend because they're going to want to make it all about that specific thing. But if you do want some of the Ultimate Legends that are coming out, you might want to start taking a look at your roster right now. Um, the only one that I have that's of really, really high value is this Eric Berry. Now, you can see that he's hovering around the 1 million coins. Um, I was able to, to put together his set for about 200k because I had a lot of items in my binder, which I tell you guys all the time, when you grind out solos, hold on to your cards. Do not get rid of your cards because one way or another, you're going to need them for a set. And that's just the way it goes. So if I wanted to get rid of him, I could do it. Regardless of what golden ticket is released or whatever happens, 
he's his card is going to maintain a decent value simply because I don't see the elite tokens dropping in that value. And what I mean by that, so I could go ahead and touch base with you, so you have an overall understanding of what's going on, the cards get a lot better now. So because the cards get a lot better now, people are going to be more greedy. More on Xbox than PS4, but they're going to be more greedy. For instance, right here, if you try to start to complete Elite Tokens, what's going to happen is these 82 overalls, their price is going to be pretty decent. You know what I'm saying? You might get a little lucky, 9,000, you see they went down, but... When you, when you start dealing with the other variations, like the 84 to 99s, you got to do these, you'll see that people are making decent bank off of the elite cards. So if you have any of these cards that are inside your binder right now, start getting rid of them. Do everything you have to do to put together as many coins as possible, because EA Sports only does this at the end of the year, and the more you do, the more you're going to be able to get back. So that's why I'm trying to make sure that everybody is understanding about that. Because, like, for instance, do I have anything I could sell? See, that's a gnat, and the other one was a gnat. I got that twice, and they were both gnats. And that guy's a gnat, too. So all these guys are gnats that I have for 90 to 91, um, 88 to 89. Do I have anything that could be sold? Okay, this guy. Okay, so how much is he going for? Um, okay, so he's up to what? What is, what, is, what is the base price? All right, so they're about 15. They're about 15K a pop. For like the 84 to 99s up, you would say. And then you saw some of them for 9,000 and change for the 82 to 83. A week ago, they were at 15K. So that's just to give you an idea about it. So whatever you have in your binder, start putting together your coins now. Okay? Get everything together and take advantage while EA is giving away free stuff. Thank you guys and girls for watching. You enjoy your day. G Myers World. One love.